Hello guys, how you doing? So, I'm going to watch episode 6 of Rearen today and I'm curious to see what's going to happen during um, this fight against um, uh, that dragon. Right now the group is um, uh, increasing, so Stark is, uh, I believe, um, joining them not only um, for this fight against the dragon, but um, afterwards um, as well, like hopefully they will be able to, to defeat the dragon. Um, but yeah, it's uh, definitely going to be interesting to um, to see like um, how things uh, will happen. Like this, uh, more like this uh, coordination between the, the three of them. And I also want to see um, how strong um, Stark is uh, right now because um, like we saw like his story and how um, he didn't actually do anything against the dragon before. But like people believed that um, he was like the hero who saved them. Uh, but now he's like trying really hard to to actually become this um, this warrior and and to be able to uh, to fight. So there was like this um, this big mountain that uh, he was like pretty much uh, I don't know if trying to split or just uh, like doing it um, like um, he was definitely like uh, uh, practicing. But uh, I don't know if like the goal was to split the mountain or just like to like keep smacking it and stuff and to like check um, his damage so either way it's pretty clear that um, he has uh, s some power and uh, I want to see how he will perform against um, this dragon because he has to buy some time for uh, Frieren and Fern to do um, their thing so with this just hope you guys are ready and let's start the episode Hmm. It's going to be fun to like see these his personalities all together. It's what makes um like this kind of groups uh, re really fun, right? Like we we have all been seeing these these like moments from the heroes group. Like how the four of them had completely different personalities. But then together, it was like fun. And I'm not too sure if um, it kind of feels like uh, Frieren is... It's like she's having... Um, a group of her own right now. Before I believe she joined the group, it was Emil's uh, group. At least that's how I think it was. But now it's uh, it's her, like uh, first uh, Fern uh, tagging along with her, now Stark joining her and her group as well. I don't know if there's going to be more um, or not. I don't know if there's going to be four like it was before. But either way, it's interesting to to think about these these things that happen. It's like details. Oh. These, what I talked about before. He wants to live up to that name. Oh, are they going to show it? Oh. 
Ask and you shall receive. It's crazy. It was with his bare hand. Hmm. Oh, it's... It's from before. For she met Frieren, right? Oh no, they were together already. I was like trying to see if she was like a young kid. Or if she was like already grown up, then hmm, yeah, that's a good point. Like when the time comes, it's like he will have the resolve to do it. Well, I have to see. I also believe that he's... Oh. Hmm. I don't know if that was it or not. I don't want to believe he just ran away. Oh. <laughs> she wanted to do that again. <laughs> oh, he's here. <laughs> it's so funny how Fer uh, uh, Fern was just like hugging the tree. <laughs> She didn't want any of that. Oh. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you shouldn't really talk about time with Frieren. Like, it's not going to be the same for her. Three years is like, like, <laughs> three hours for her. Like, I don't know. <laughs> Damn. 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 Hmm. Damn, it's exactly the same. I really love this this kind of development. Imagine if he defeated the dragon all by himself. I don't think it's going to happen, but. Oh, damn. Sweet. Oh. 
Damn. So even before the dragon felt like Stark's like strength, it's crazy. So I guess I was wrong, he didn't attack the village because of Stark, in the end. I was like wondering why he just turned away. Damn! Oh. She want him to... Oh my god. It's already dead? He didn't even notice. Damn. He didn't even notice the amount of damage he... It actually happened what I was like... Wondering. I thought it would be like cool if it defeated him alone, but I didn't think it was going to happen. But considering we, considering what they said after, he's really strong. <laughs> she was already taking dual sync. Hmm. <laughs> oh. Man, I really love these, these moments. I'm so glad they keep showing it. And it's like, every time they show it, there's like a meaning to it. It's not like just showing it because... Oh. <laughs> she going to do it on him. Wait, what the... <laughs> what exactly was small? Hey, that's really nice. I already feel like they're going to be so close together. Oh. That's a problem. He's a really big guy.
<laughs> He's excited. <laughs> They're just like staring at her. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> It reminds me of that Pepe emote or something, the stare one. <laughs> They're really funny. Oh. What if they help with that? I mean, at this point, they kind of need to, right? If they want to keep going. Oh, damn, that looks really good. Look at the size of that. Sure, it really... <laughs> the one they showed before when he was with Aizen looked much bigger. I guess he's just going with it. <laughs> he's still like... Not really sure. Oh. Imagine if she got the big one. <laughs> she really wanted him to be on the same page. <laughs> Man, Fernie is so precious. It's really funny. Like her personality. Oh, damn. Yeah, that's a good point. Yes, it's going to be some moments between the two of them while Freer and Dozer sing. Oh. Is it really though? <laughs> oh. Holy, <laughs> yeah, it's, I don't think it's working. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, he's like really into it. Yeah, like it's what you want to. Oh. Wait. It doesn't have a lot of time. What does he mean by that? Does he have like some condition that he won't be able to live for like a normal time?
Now I'm worried about him. Oh. oh, is that why he wants to do as much as possible to share with him before he passes away? So that's it, right? Okay, now it's more clear. That's really nice of him. Man, it was such a beautiful reason. I was like becoming worried about him. But it was totally different. Just beautiful to see these relationships. Oh. <laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> Man, Frieren is like so... He's so funny. It's the guy again. Did you notice? He did. <laughs> it really like felt like you looked at him by the end. What the? What is going on? Oh. She actually wants to stay here <laughs> for those magic thingies. They're going. <laughs> I feel a bit sad about Frieren, but it is what it is. They need to keep moving. Again, it's like different for her, like it wouldn't be that long for her, but it's different for Stark and Fern. <laughs> Isn't it a bit like before? I think I remember... Something like this, when uh, Emil and the others, like when this hero group was also going for these. I feel like they showed this before, I think even during the first episode, when they were going for the Demon King, when they started the journey. But maybe it wasn't in this place, it was like at the other one, where they started the journey. But again, it's just like really nice to see these, these like details. Really enjoying this story so far. And then it's really entertaining because not only is like a really interesting story and also like very emotional sometimes but there's also this uh, like fun side to it like watching these three together like the things that they do to each other these reactions that they have as well just really funny I wonder what they're going to have to deal with at this next place. Like they will have to... It's like the... 
It's the remaining forces of the Demon King, right? Or like the the remnants of it, or so to say. I'm not too sure if that was it or not. It's don't remember too well. But either way, they're going to have to deal with them to keep uh, keep going. Yeah, that was that was a really really nice episode. I really enjoyed this specific part with um, with Stark and how. How it was like totally different from what I was thinking before, especially this part about um, when uh, he faced this dragon the first time, and like we just saw, it's like it was. Uh, I still remember him saying that the dragon was cutting those uh, like places like vegetables or something, but then um, it just went away. So I was a bit confused why exactly that had happened. Like. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if he was just like bored or something and decided to leave, but uh, there was actually another reason. So he actually felt this um, strong presence, uh, like uh, in Stark. So that was um, that was definitely like really nice to learn about how Stark was um, like always. Uh, it's like he he always had this. Uh, it's like presence or something. I'm not too sure about the exact uh, like way to put it, um, but uh, it was like uh, like fearsome. And even with Ison, like there was that uh, that whole thing about uh, him punching uh, punching uh, Stark, um, and uh, then he explained that it wasn't uh, like it was a mistake. It, it was just like reflex because he was afraid um, of Stark. So that was definitely something um, unexpected, but um, really interesting to learn um, about. And then he just proceeded to defeat the dragon alone. So that was something um, that I was imagining it would be like something if Stark could just uh, uh, do that. But at the same time, he was working together with Freeran and Fern. So I saw that um, it wasn't going to happen, that they were still going to um, do it um, uh, uh, together. Uh, but uh, I mean, it just... Um, he just did it without even like noticing it. So that was uh, something and uh, already tells me um, how strong um, he can be if he defeated um, this dragon um, just like this. Um, but yeah, it's uh, definitely going to be a good uh, like a good addition to this group, not only like to make it more fun, but also in terms of uh, like adding um, like power to it, like uh, f uh, for them to be able to fight against um, stronger enemies. So definitely excited to see um, like what else is going to happen. Like more specifically, uh, this um, next one. So with this, hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this episode. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.